Ooh. Welcome back to Atomic Heart. We're gonna go into that thing. Get the new part of the map, maybe probably, realistically. Unless I find myself a computer, then I'm gonna listen to the computer music for 10 hours. And not just the fridge music. I'm pretty much too twice through here. There was this gigantic house back there and there was just no PC in there with PC music because that's also pretty quite good. And look at that house, you can't go inside. That's why it's completely empty inside. There's nothing in there. A view atomic heart. This is recorded on the same day as Sons of the Forest comes out. Early access. I kind of was thinking to myself that I want to play Sons of the Forest a little bit, but uh, since this is definitely far from getting finished, I already skipped out on finishing Returnal. And Scars Above looks more interesting to me and my playstyle wise and well, sci fi. Sci fi, I like sci fi, it looks sci fi. Scars Above is definitely sci fi. That's after Atomic Heart, the next let's play plan. Yeah. Maybe get some more copyrighted music, which is kind of the theme of this game. Streamer mode is not working. It looks like there's nothing on here, but I still need to check. Not that I miss some important loot parts. Okay, looks clean. Looks clean. I'm guessing this will be a cutscene. So, face cam, put the hell away. Oh, damn. Look at this fancy bad boy. And some nice music too. What's that? A bratwurst? Unbelievable. No currywurst though. <laughs> uh, damn, I dig this. Good job. Greetings, comrade. Welcome aboard Vortex, the unique ah. high-speed train and the crown jewel of Facility 3826 Transportation System. Vortex Mod Manager. If the new game releases start to slow down, I'm probably gonna do more Fallout mods. Fallout 4 that is. I need to get to the VDNH right away. It will be my pleasure, comrade. The current load of the train line is... Zero percent. You may depart immediately. Thank you. Are you sure you haven't lost your marbles like those robots? I don't need to read that. Oops. Are you sure you haven't lost your marbles like those other robots? You're not gonna crash the train and kill us, are you? Passenger safety is the foremost concern of any robotic vehicle. Our algorithms? I've seen what your algorithms can do. Charles. Is there a neuropolymer capsule with a train manual on it in this station? You can drive the Vortex yourself if we find one. Unfortunately, this station isn't a transit hub. There won't be a manual capsule here. Oh, fuck. Great, oh. let's go. Assuming you have purchased a ticket. A, a ticket? A fucking ticket? Are you stupid? There are corpses everywhere. There's an emergency protocol in effect over the entire facility. Start the train right now! According to Soviet law, free travel is available only to pregnant women and people with disabilities. I do not detect any signs of pregnancy. Show me a note from the gynecologist. I'll show you signs of pregnancy, you piece of shit. If you have a mental disability, please present your disability certificate. That's it. You're fucked. Comrade Major. Note that this particular Rafik is not an autonomous system. He is the high-speed train Vortex. Destroying him will permanently disable the train. All right. Listen here, you lousy hunk of junk. Where do I get your fucking ticket? You may purchase it at the nearest ticket window. There are special discounts available for passengers traveling with children. Uh, uh -huh. What ticket window, you dumb shit? They're closed. Everyone's dead. 
Nobody's selling tickets. According to Soviet law, free travel is available only to pregnant women and women. Cram it, you prick! I'll end up hoofing it all the way to the VDNH at this rate. A unique train? What makes it so special? Does it fly through the air or something? Thanks to the revolutionary maglev transportation system developed by Chalamet engineers, Vortex high-speed train can reach incredible speeds with no inconvenience to the passengers. An inextricable part of the neural network... I'm almost out of time. Fine, whatever. I'm out of here. Oh, so let's get someone pregnant. I guess that's the only course of action here. Uh, what am I supposed to do now? Search every single body here? I suggest oh. talking to the polymerized victims. Shit. Do I have to? Where do you lead me? Oh, insanity. Only saw one guy. Oh, there are multiple. Maybe we can take the corpse of a pregnant woman. Or would that be too effed up? Let's see who we have here. Hey, you don't look too good. The window is closed. I need a train ticket. A ticket? What the hell are you talking about? There are crazy robots all over the place. Help! They're killing me! Oh. You already got killed, buddy. Shouting like that isn't gonna do shit. I've got to hide! Get away! You'll tick me off to the robots! You're hidden, okay? The bots will never find you. Now, can you tell me where I can get a train ticket? I'm not opening the ticket window! The robots will see me! Ask someone else for a ticket! They don't have names on them! Uh, okay. What's the nearest corpse? You. That's the one in the back, 100% sure. You, sir. Hi. Rescue. Failure. Excuse me, comrade, <laughs> but do you have a train ticket? Must go. Ramen key. Emergency. What? Failed everyone. People dying. Elimination was correct. Son. Asshole. Holy hell, I'm wasting my fucking time here. Robots. Not glad to be of service. Not glad. I'll keep that in mind. I gotta go. Be not the brightest man. Ah, oh, this train is dope, though. And one of my favorite colors. Red. Yeah. He probably has nothing to tell me, Dad. You're not I looking too good. I just can't. I can't leave this place, literally. You don't have a spare ticket, do you, comrade? A ticket? Yes, I do have a ticket, but it's useless. How come? Because this station is jinxed. Can't you see? <laughs> I'd use a different word, but I don't want to upset you. There's no other practical explanation. It's a jinx. I'm telling you. First, I overslept. Then I forgot my papers. Then I forgot the departure time. And then I almost missed the train. And when I got here one minute before departure, everything froze before my eyes. This station is jinxed. Why don't I help you get rid of your jinx ticket and your backward superstitions, comrade? Take it, take it, and break the jinx. Thanks. Not sure about the jinx, though. What? We actually got him from him and didn't need to go all the way back. Uh, impossible. <coughs> Weird. Oh yeah, oopsie, no, nope, no, nope, stop it. No fondling with yourself. That uh, was looking good, almost, almost. Okay. Do, 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 do. Copyrighted music, please don't be copyrighted Greetings, this time. Comrade. Welcome aboard Vortex, the unique high-speed train and the crown jewel of facility Thirsty. Shut it. Here's your ticket. Now start the engine. Your ticket has expired. Your train departed four hours ago. Please exchange the expired ticket at the ticket window. You Are mother. you shitting me? 
expired? Everyone here was already dead four hours ago. Have you just been going back and forth the entire time? Start the engine before I kick your metal ass. Riding with an expired ticket is unworthy of a Soviet citizen. Please exchange the expired ticket at the ticket window. Choke on it and die, you fat turd. Oh my god. Fine. Whatever. I'm out of here. Oh, it would have been too easy, wouldn't it? Oh god damn you, game. Damn you. No tickets for me. No. Zero. Zero tickets. Oh yeah, but the damn this comes out. I also have released my last Dead Space part. Which of course is story PowerPoint here as hell. God damn it, that's basically a complete fork show of PC style problems and overheating. Oh, what the hell was that noise that hit my ear? Uh, it's, uh, it's the one I need. Uh, it's, God damn it. I already know I need to go uh, through it to it, to it see, from the outside. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Oh, it's that. Disgusting. Also, my recording just cut itself short in between the PowerPoint presentation. So, the official landing never got recorded. Can I have your uh. train ticket, comrade? It's an emergency. Are you alive? Then run! You can make it! Leave the area! I can't. I'm the guy who's gonna clean up this mess. This is exactly what we thought when we sounded the alarm. And now we're kind of... I'm guessing your ticket's expired then, huh? I have a monthly pass. Has it been a month yet? How long have I been lying here? Ah, it hasn't been a month. Mind if I borrow your pass, comrade? You don't need it anymore. And that fucking Rafik on the train is busting my balls. You saw a Rafik? Do not approach it under any circumstances. Rafiks kill you if you try talking to them. They sure do. Talking to that metal moron is making me want to kill myself. So how about that pass? What about it? <laughs> have you got a pass or not? I have. Take it. It's, it's in my pocket. I can't reach it. I'll get it. Thanks, comrade. Do not approach graphics. They're dangerous. Oh, black and red. Nice. <clears throat> I will approach it. I do not have another choice in the matter. <clears throat> Damn that noise. I hope it wasn't so bad on your end. God, the sprinting is non-existent. Okay. That just took my attention away for way too long. Please, let me out of here. Good sir. I need to catch Brian. Go to the next area. But little side quests like that are very appreciated. They bring a lot of charisma to this game. Hello sir. Greetings, comrades. Is this ticket okay? Will you let me ride now, you blood sucker? Why didn't you notify me you had a travel document, comrade? It could speed up the departure of the train. Maybe because I didn't have it back then. Are you saying this isn't your ticket? Riding <laughs> with someone else's ticket is unworthy of a Soviet citizen. What did you just say? Please do not worry. Having analyzed the situation, I came to the conclusion that you are a law enforcement officer investigating an emergency. It is obvious that you are allowed to travel free of charge under the current circumstances. <laughs> oh my god. Are you serious? Feel free to take any available seat. The train is departing in 10 seconds. Wow, we just witnessed a real miracle of science. The train is now departing. Next up, Solnechnaya Station. Oh, I uh, can't take any seat Charles, I want. Professor Zaharov's death seems pretty cut and dry to me. What's so suspicious about it? We've already been over this. There are too many unanswered questions. Hey, I need to get to the bottom of this. Sechenov's the only family I've got, okay? 
I understand, Comrade Major, but what do you need to get to the bottom of? I can't even imagine Sechenov killing his best friend. That's just crazy. I mean, why would he do it? Why, indeed. That is, unless Zaharov betrayed him like his other colleagues did. Dr. Filatova, for example. Filatova went after Petrov. She's a woman in love. She wasn't thinking straight. Oh, fuck. What's that thing? Oh, boy. Cannonball! Oh, crispy critters! Hold on! Are you fucking serious? Oh. Solnechnaya Station. Next stop. Oh god, oh boy. Don't let yourself get crushed. Oh no. Who the hell is that guy? No time for a dirt nap, Stuck. Get your ass up and head to cover. Spill it. What did Seishinov say? Uh, okay, okay. Easy it's like, now. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, Comrade Molotov is on his way Head here down. to the... Uh, okay. Uh, Comrade Seishinov wants you to go there right now and in initiate an emergency drill. Uh, got it? What the hell for? Okay, uh, fair enough. Uh, okay. Anything else? Uh, Comrade Seishinov asked me to give you this. Huh. This'll come uh, in You're a soldier, Agent B3. Your job is to cover me. What are you doing? So just cover me! Huh? Wait, where are you going? Bah, slippery little bitch! I'll feed us in! What are you looking at? You think you can slap me? <gasps> I'm gonna ask you a question. Oh, no, 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 no! No, 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 no. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Interesting new tech. They have stun batons now. Holy hell, that's cool. And force shields. Okay. Really still works though. Get over here, you little fucker! Damn. It's pretty here. Just like Moscow. Better, actually. More futuristic. And on a larger scale. My design. Your what? A linguistic error. I meant to say that it embodies my favorite design. Where's the loot there? So far, I haven't seen too much of this place. Hello, comrade. It just told me pretty much get loot here with the quick tip or the text. Get yourself loot. I just want the PC. There I'm okay, I see what's what's that pretty. Looking pretty good. Poor train. Didn't know what hit him. Well Fox jumps over the lazy dog. His I mind is one. completely gone. I can't keep going like that please enough oh poor guy pain is the last thing you can remember tough luck i can't work so much i need at <laughs> least one day off this must be one of the developers working on collective 2.0 software they had a few difficult days before the neural network update and brutal deadlines same old story well you got all the time in the world now buddy Forgive us! You're We fucked everything! He has expired. Charles, I keep thinking, what's up with their voices? As far as I can tell, the talking corpse's polymer memory is transmitting an audio stream through the interactive speech module installed in the thought device's voice assistant. So, in other words, they talk through the neurocontroller? So it would seem. When the thought controllers were initially distributed, only two voice profiles had been created, a male one and a female one. 
That's why their voices seem so similar. Needless to say, these people spoke quite ordinarily when they were alive. But they promised to significantly increase the range of voice profiles. Is that why you've got that weird, wheezy voice? It's rude to mock a man for something that is beyond his control, Comrade Major. <laughs> Whatever. I was just messing with you. You've got a nice, sultry baritone. <laughs> a man. That's not baritone. Now it's excuse for that and lore and backstory. Not so much excuse though. Very nicely explained. Would make sense. Makes sense to me, I would say. I can't use the elevator. Nope. Not good enough. Comrade. Let's look around. <laughs> yeah, this is nice looking. Look at that thing. Funny spy balloon up here. That's a statue. Oh, you creep. Come on, not that hooker bot again. Watch out, there are robots beneath us. Really? I thought they were ladybugs. Access granted. Oh, not good enough. Damn, I'm missing so little. So, so what so will much. it be, Major? Oh, it's called Cola. Bum, bum, bum. I got that in Greece already. Dodge, two dodges. Laser resistance. Ugh, can I kind of frostbite it up. No, nope. I mean, I could hear. I feel like that sounds the best. The next one. Yes. Let's save it. Dun, dun, dun. And let's save it again. Saving data. Damn, this has been an amazing episode so far. Story wise, character wise, lore wise. Combat, not so much, I guess, but. Rah, rah, rah. Ah, okay. To my left side or to my right side first. Let's. Boah. Damn it. That's where the train got hoofed. I probably can't go through here though. I mean through this ring. I probably can't go through this ring. I'm gonna check out the train first. Ha! Huh, this game surprises me with how much well built up it is after that underground area let's nice drop kick fail oh. Come on, that's a loot box. Damn it. Let's check it out if there's something in the train. <coughs> Looks like there ain't a thing. Boxes. Creeps. Kickboxing, <laughs> kickboxing right here. Damn it! Oh. Oh. What a headshot. Oh. Kickboxing. Yeah. Why is it lower half? No looter. Big boy rockets. I don't even know what it is used for. I mean, it gotta be almost like the Fallout gun when it's called Fed Boy. 
not a fat man, but a fat boy. Funny enough, um, fat boy, the place I work at, there are some extra big billows that people can lay on called fat boys. Which are more fat goddamn pillows to sleep on with your whole body. <laughs> fat boys are now. Boba. I might need a double ch 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 charge. Okay, let's look over here then. Loot. Okay, she got me. No! Damn it. Keep the distance, man. Comrade Major, based on the enemy's alert level data, you are fucked. I didn't see the camera. Damn it! <clears throat> but there ain't really anything around me. Did it drop something here? Oh boy. Oh boy. Yep, I see it. I see why I'm fucked. Maybe they won't come up here. Otherwise I need to hold the line here. Okay. Damn it. How do I use that? Damn it. How do I use you? Damn. Takes care of business. Do something left. Yep, I see it. Saw it real quick. There. Are they trying to repair my damage? Yes, they are. Damn you robots. Don't need that energy. The hell off here. Damn you. More coming, damn it. And find myself a new safe spot. Yeah, all the energy too. Well, I can definitely find myself a new safe spot. Fading data. There must have been a camera right here somewhere. Uh. <coughs> yes, there is. That's so hard to say. So hard. 
There's some bee around me. Oh, that's the repair station. That's a guy. Oh, missed. Damn it! Not a fork again! Jesus Christ! Oh, too many. Too many! Oh! They can't come in here, right? Damn, that thing is just perfectly timed. How do you like that gearhead? Oh, <laughs> no, get the fuck away. Oh, God damn it, I need to get away from here. I need to get away from here, he said. I need to get away. Saving data. Yeah, holy what the hell. They keep on repairing them. They gotta stop at some point, right? I mean, there's no more. <laughs> there's no safe station left at that. Oh boy. You've got a big fight ahead of you. More enemies incoming. No. Damn it. Oh, can I be that goddamn screwed? Again. I go up here. What can I do? So I can't go through here, so I need to go out all the way back to the other safe spots while I'm kickboxing my way around here. I probably should just stuff around. Good loot. Music is getting intense too, damn. Okay.
됐어. On the way inside. <laughs> Damn. It's insane how quickly. <laughs> Things turned from zero to a hundred. Pots already here. Damn! I can't even run around. They're already here too. Damn it. <laughs> Who's the man? Oh, they're already getting repaired. Oh, God. I'm just not getting out of fight here. That's the problem. <laughs> Look at that guy. He's already above here. Oh my god. Okay, one safe station. Oh, and now I'm gonna pause it and record the next part. Yo, thanks for watching. Peace out.